Yeah. Jack, you're a lot bigger than me than than I don't like that. Than, than, than what you used to be. Yeah, yeah, you're getting there. <laughs> I mean, you're rolling early for that, right? You're rolling early. Getting the weight to yeah. hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm feeling good. How's uh, how has been enrolling early? How's been in school? Being, are y'all roomies? Mm -mm. Are y'all not allowed to room together? Cause you are your freshman, you're a sophomore. Yeah. Uh, or no, you just don't like each other enough to remember. We don't. We can't remember. Yeah. yeah. We're in the other soon, though. That's for sure. Yeah. Maybe so. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sounds yeah. like trouble, right? You gotta earn your key. It's earn your key. stripes. That's it. Earn your stripes it. before you get room with the other classmates. <laughs> yeah. How's it been? How's it, how's uh enrolling early? How's been? How's being? How's Brian Kelly? How's learning a whole new system? How's that all been going? Coach Kelly's awesome. I mean, enrolling early is one of the coolest things. Really. Cause you go from that high school transition straight to college. Like I was in high school a month ago, and I've been waiting to get in this. Were you really tradition. in high school? Like, is you really? Yeah, senior itis bad. I'm assuming. Oh, you the itis had to be bad. You knew. He knew. Oh, he knew. Oh my God. Second semester when you like going and you all like when you were going like your senior year, your second semester. Mine was the first. That's day my of point. School. My first day of school was like, oh come on. You had football season, and then after yeah. football season, I'm out. Oh, when, fo Peace. when football season gone. ended, I was just like, I'm, I'm gone. Ready to, I'm ready to get out of here. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I was ready got here, but I heard the rumor was you were here every weekend with him though. That was a rumor. A couple. A couple that was a of rumor. Weekends. Showing the ropes. A couple of the weekends trying to. And how about you? Your your experience has been been unbelievable yeah. this year. You're freshman all American. You yeah. balled out. You had uh it look I have, do have a question actually. Just so one? the bowl game you just one? No, I have a few. Okay, all right. But out. the bowl game, you ran on the field, played for a play, and came off the field and then got in trouble. Were you not supposed to play? Now what happened was <laughs> see what happened. I went on the field. What happened was, I went on the field. This guy's not gonna be the play. head coach. Yeah. I can get out of here. I mean, y'all seen how I played the whole year. That one, the yeah. one play oh, yeah, on the right. field. My friend got tackled out of bounds, and the dude wanted to get off him. Right. So I basically kind of got. You the did dude. what you're supposed to do. I pushed him off. I told him some stuff. Basically, like this is my this is my guy. Don't be doing that to me. Yeah. Dude. Didn't like what I was saying. He kind of like we kind of <laughs> tried to a little bit, and I threw a flag. <laughs> you right. didn't get the flag. Like, no, yeah. So, I so, it was on you too. right. So I was like, all right. So this man played all game, gets in the game, game personal foul, out, out. Straight like that. Gave it as a Straight like that. Straight like that. I'm looking for number eight. All game into the field, and all of a sudden he's getting in someone's face, and they go like this. I'm like, yeah, straight like that. Yeah. So the whole they were like, I mean, the coaches were. Pretty mad at yeah, me. Yeah, of course. They're like, like, are you like, are you serious? Like, come on. I'm like, I'm telling you, this isn't gonna be on me. Like, this dude pushed me, then I kind of pushed him, but they saw that first. And yeah. They threw the flag. I was like, is it gonna be on me? I'm telling y'all. And they call it. It wasn't on me. I was like, I told y'all it wasn't gonna be on me. <laughs> so then, so so then you didn't get back. So what? Like, were you? Like, you only played that one play, right? Well, yeah, I had I played like two or three plays, but I had a I had COVID. That's what um, it was. I probably could have played. Yeah, but they're I think they kind of just wanted to keep me healthy. Yeah, not do anything dumb. How are you? Are you healthy? Are you like you went through the first oh, yeah, full, first full season in the yeah, SEC? It's yeah. got to be tough. I feel great. I'm ready to go again. Um, I can play a game tomorrow. Love yeah. that. Hey, talk to us. Talk to us about year one, dude. Like, how was it? How was the transition? What was it the was, difference? Like, what, what, what? it was cool. I loved it because not many people like kind of thought I was gonna be able to do what I did. I thought, but it. I knew I was gonna be able to do that. Yeah, you know. So it was fun, just kind of proving everybody wrong and not riding in high. And staying high, but kind of coming in low, and and then making my own way. Making you know, making it was fun. I love that. It was, it was a lot of fun. What uh, what are you looking for? So, what's the difference, I guess? And like, I'm not trying to get anybody in trouble. I'm not trying to start anything. What's the biggest difference between the staff now and the the last staff that just left? Yeah, probably. Um, we haven't done much with like the whole staff, but we've right. been in the weight room a lot. Right. Coach Moffitt was a legend. Yep. Yeah. What three or four national championships? Been there since what two thousand? I don't even know when he was yeah. when he got there. Yeah, like beast. Like coach, uh, one of my uncles, like one of the best dudes you could ever meet. One of the best strength trainers you could ever meet. Um, but you know, like there's always need for change. Yeah, and with change comes growth if if it's approached the right way. And this I just guy, think maybe this guy we spend some stuff, some we, truth we, over we, here. Trying to keep this guy off the field. Things change need to happen. Yeah. Um, this is gonna be a new era of. LSU football that I'm excited for, and I think it's going to be kicked off with hopefully a natty next year. Love that. I, we have the talent of the portal. We have the talent already on the team. Um, this coaching staff is on us. Discipline what? is like one of their main right. things, um, holding each other accountable, all that type of stuff. But I think with that and the talent we have on our team, how couldn't we do something big next year? 
Love that. Love, Love give me some energy there. Give me a little energy. Nice little breath of fresh air. So same air. no doubt. Same question, sorta, of, but it's it's a little bit different. How was it what was your experience in the recruiting? Obviously you're a five star, you came out mm-hmm. number one quarterback no. in the country. What? 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 <laughs> uh and so you have to go, you get recruited by <laughs> Coach O. He's gone, and then you get recruited by Brian Kelly, and it's just kind of this limbo period for a while. How how was that, and how was the transit? How has been? How has the transition from Powers been in that in that sense, or was it in that sense? I mean, it's it's hard to pl- replace Coach O. I mean, I love Coach O. He's done so much for me, and I mean, he gave me a great opportunity. But um, you know, it's sad to see him leave. But uh, you know, I love Coach Kelly. I've seen. I went up to Notre Dame on a visit, and. I mean, yeah, we know. I, I wasn't. Really <laughs> he goes, yeah, we know. He was Lloyd was Lloyd was freaking out, thinking you're going up to South Bend. Oh. Lloyd was looking at the flights trying to come bring you back down. He's going to South Bend. He realized how cold it is hey, up there. Church he ain't is going only to South once Bend. a week up there. We're seven days a year. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I mean, South Bend was it was just different. I mean, obviously, I wanted to be at LSU. I mean, yeah, Notre Dame's cool, but I mean, their coach of staff. I, I like their coach of staff a lot, just because. It was just like a, like another place. If something did happen at LSU, it'd be a place I could. So I actually with. about their coaches. So Tommy Reese, there's a lot of rumors about him coming and staying, doing all these different things. How is he? How was he when you were talking to him? How is he as an offensive coordinator? How is he as a recruiter? How is he as a person? Like, because he's a little younger. Right. Obviously, he's been there. He went to go to Notre Dame. Went to Notre Dame. Was a star at Notre Dame. Now he's offensive coordinator at Notre Dame. How has, how was how was talking to him? I don't know much about him. So. I'm just curious. No, yeah, so, I mean, Coach Reese, he's a really, he's a really good dude. He's cool. He's young. I mean, this season. What's wrong with you? Hey, <laughs> hey, he was meant for the spotlight, huh? <laughs> this guy is meant for the spotlight. I'm not changing. He's over there like Don't this. Keep talking about <laughs> we talked about superstar side with Joey B. And this guy's doing it right here in front, in front of us. I love that. Oh, yeah, but Sorry, go ahead. Go ahead. He's still your thunder. Blame it on him. Yeah, it's, it's, Let's blame it on him. Yeah, Jack, why don't we all follow Leak and Riley real quick and see how that gets us? <laughs> Today's a gist of Bro, Jack. Was, is that you that did that? Tell no, me about that, actually. He, was, he literally was like, he was like, dude, you want to stir something up? <laughs> no. I was like, oh, like, oh, like, oh, like this is the only time he's hiding. He's over here behind the mic right now. He's like, oh, shit. I was on the way to, like, my semifinal game. Like, like I was literally, I was like, well, of course. He goes, it was like right before we do our team mass, right? So I was like, goes, go follow Lincoln Riley. So okay. both, of, both of us, I think you're both, I think I followed him. At one, I think I already followed him, but I think you didn't follow him, did you? But I unfollowed and followed with a work pop up. Anything. So we popped up. He's going quiet. A bit I really just wanted to see if people would like actually take notice. Like, if we were actually, they did. Oh, they did. You know, you're the whole reason why he got paid at USC. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, really, that shit. Really, yeah. yeah. But uh, it was it was so funny when he did that because like we didn't think it was a big thirty deal. minutes later. Thirty, 30 minutes, minutes later. later, it was on like was, bar stool. Oh my god, yeah. bar stool. Yeah. Yeah. Bro, they called him up and I was like, oh, I they're was like, OMG. Jack's like, and then like bar stool's post like tweeting out like, oh, you thanks for ruining it, like all this stuff, like yeah. like me and Jack ruined it all for everybody that USC. But like we really thought Lincoln Riley was the guy. For yeah, wow. really. Like we were told by like these big like the big donors and like all this. Shows stuff. you how much they nobody knew. Then nobody knew. Like nobody literally, knew. it was like Lincoln Riley done dealing. Like Jack told me that he's like talked to multiple people. Like we're like, oh yeah. And then all of a sudden, it just went. In yeah, let me send, let me send a little follow out his way and see what happens. Like, <laughs> I, lo- I love it. It was so interesting. Hey. Start <laughs> and he goes, of course, of course. Yeah, I'm in. I said, I'm, I'm in. in. Okay. I'll You've been on the bass. Let's, let's, let's just let's just hit the let's hit the hornet's nest with a, with a tennis racket. And see what happens. I, like, I didn't touch my phone for like that like that hour or whatever. For yeah, like I was like workouts or something. So too. like right when I t- looked at my phone, it was just like like yeah, alert, 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 alert. I had like Twitter two hundred hey, hey, honestly, more you know, followers. All that, all that really tells me is that. Boys like being thrown in the fire. They like oh, that. Yeah. They like yeah. right in the middle of the heat. Yeah. So you're you're you were senior. You're a junior. You started as a junior. You got, which I think is nuts that you're getting offered. Not nuts in a bad way, but like you're getting offered scholarships before you even really started in high school. Yeah, right? I was thinking the same thing. I was like, <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I was like man, this guy must have balled out at the camps Dude. because he's not. He hadn't even started yet, and he's getting big time offers That's from what, everybody. I saw I've been going to those camps since I was in eighth grade, and they're like always. But like when I was in eighth grade, I didn't go to the middle school camps. I went to like the high school camps. But uh, yeah. But like like all since eighth grade. But like I every year I'd go. I started talking to these coaches. Started doing the camps, and the recruiting process just kind of started a little early for me. Yeah. But like you said, 
kind of weird seeing a guy that wasn't starting a game. I remember like looking on the sidelines, I was like, dude, if I saw a guy that was getting offered by LSU, Alabama, like Alabama's like everyone's winning national championships over here. I'm like, who would offer a kid that's playing JV quarterback over there? <laughs> I was thinking the same thing y'all were. I was just like, I mean, what is going so on? So you balled out your junior year, right? Like at SDM. How many touchdowns did you throw to Jack? Like 20, I think. Yeah, like, like only, eight games. Only 20. That's it? Games. Only 20. That's all you got? Yeah, it was only like 20. I'm just joking. <laughs> I'm just joking. I'm just joking. I'm just joking. It was only 20. And y'all won the state championship. Oh, yeah. So how many, wait, wait how many did you catch in the state championship? How many did y'all connect on the state championship? I went for like 14, two or three. like 240. <laughs> how many tugs? I mean, when they, when they leave the hitch open the Catholic? whole game. Yeah, it's stupid. I mean, they're uh, literally playing off uh, of Jack, and I was like, why would you do this? They're scared. They don't so get throw the like hitch and he runs fun. all day long. He just runs over people. Yeah, it was, high school was fun. Yeah, I, <laughs> we, knew, we knew, like, we knew every time I stepped on the field my senior year, like his junior, we knew we weren't losing. So right. it was so fun. Yeah. Like, we knew we were about to run clean over whoever we were Did playing. y'all have anyone else go play Division One that so, year? Or was it just y'all two? So Carter Domingue's playing Division One basketball yeah. at UL. Yeah, he's and pretty then Carter good. Arso, he, he was playing last year. So Carter Arsenal was my best friend's cousin. Yeah. He was, uh, he's tiny, but he was a really good receiver, right? Is he J- short? Is he short? He's really not that short. He's probably like five, five, 11, inch and six. Yeah, oh, never mind. He's I really thought he was not shorter that than that. Inch and six. I mean, show that man some respect. Inch and six. Yeah, six six foot foot inches 12. is big, dude. I mean, what are y'all talking about? <laughs> 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 but yeah, I mean, um, he was, just, I mean, our receivers were studs. Yeah. Our I mean. team was so good. I like a laugh at these people are like saying like oh you y'all, y'all didn't play anybody y'all, y'all should have played us and we're like I don't think y'all could hang with us like we love scored that. we scored every time we touched the ball I love that that's what we're gonna do next year absolutely so what what are your expectations we heard his expectations what are your expectations for the, for yourself going into next year I know you're a freshman you're going in early you're gonna learn the system you're gonna go through all the summer stuff you're gonna go through two a days whatever y'all got I don't know how the how the, the it's scheduled with right. all the stuff with all the new COVID rules. I don't know if COVID is going to be a thing next year. Hopefully, we beat it. Mm-hmm. You know, God forbid, we beat COVID. Um, boost up. What? Just boost up. Just boost, no. <laughs> Just boost. We're not getting into that. Boys. No, I'm saying boot up like LSU. We're not. We're not. We're not getting into that. We're not going to. We're not going to. We're not going to go down there, and we're not going to go down that road. So, what's your expectation for yourself? What do you want to see? Do you want to? Um, actually, I'm let you talk. I'm not even gonna put words in your mouth. What do you? What are your expectations for yourself? For myself, I mean, I'm just going in there to compete. Yeah. I mean, I just want to get better at like, like having Miles burning. I think is gonna be awesome for me, just because I mean he's been there. Yep. He knows what he's doing. He knows defenses. He knows Play everything. Behind Joey. Like that's what I'm saying. He's yeah. got so much experience, and like having a guy like that come back. Like I was hoping they would bring yeah. a guy in just because for an experience, and it just makes you better. I mean, it makes everybody better. Yeah. To have experience, like know what someone's doing, like just watching their footsteps for a little bit, and like like I work out with Miles today. I mean, it's just it's good to see him because like I watch everything he does. Like when he's when he's around the team, like jogging around, he's the first one there. So I try to beat him on everything. Just try, like we like it's fun, just because it's somebody to look up to, and somebody that knows what he's doing. Like I remember there wasn't any trainers out there with water. He went and grabbed all the waters and started handing out to all the players because everyone's tired when we're running today. I mean, it's just those little things where yeah. those little Leader. things that's going to make me better. No doubt. And it's going to make the whole team better. And just yeah. having, like, guys like that, like, older guys to lead the team is going to be awesome. But I'm going in there to work my tail off. I'm going to work hard. Yep. I'm going to compete Love every that. day. And, I mean. Yeah, whatever happens, happens. Whatever happens, that, right? happens. But yeah. I'm going in there competing. So, question then. To get to act two, year two, sophomore year, what is it that Jack Besh is going to do to get better, to work on, to up the level of play next year. Yeah. What, what are like, you working on? It's really been since like my sophomore junior. It's I don't work on like one thing to get better. Like I try to like evolve my whole game each year I play. Yeah. So like with my junior to senior year, it wasn't just like me getting a little faster. Like I got bigger, stronger, faster. Yeah. EFS. Um. Whenever I switched to senior year of high school to my freshman year of college, I got bigger, stronger, faster. Like I'm trying to evolve every year. And like turn into like just like a like a just a bigger, stronger, faster, more physical, um, know the game better. Like I'm trying to evolve and take my whole game to a whole nother level, not just get my my feet quick or my legs bigger. Like I'm trying to evolve my whole game, like completely. 
Love that. So and here's the real question. Stand up wide receiver the whole time. Now he's moving. That's what I was about to ask. You took my so question yeah, from yeah, me. Bad, but yeah. I was gonna say, how was playing tight end? You really were like in a hybrid. Yeah, you were yeah, really a tight stand end. Up, put his hand. But like now head. you're gonna be an actual like, hey, you're gonna have WR next to your name, right? Like yeah. You're not gonna have the tight end. Well, they label. they set up. It's gonna be like a little bit of the hybrid role, but um, back. it's gonna be way more like. But you gotta receiver. love that because Brian Kelly is like known right. for like being able to right. take but the to thing excel is, in that position. Yeah, but the thing is, it's not gonna be like I don't, I'm never my hand is never gonna be on the ground, and I don't, I don't think I'm gonna be behind the line of scrimmage that much. I might be. Yeah, I don't really know. And but it's gonna be way more. Like, yeah. I'm not gonna be, um, like. Dude from Alabama, number 31, about oh, is going to be... Will Anderson, you're not going to be blocking so, Will Anderson? Like, I'm not about to be blocking Will Anderson on a stretch zone. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you got to make sure you get around him. You got to steal yeah. the edge. I, mean, I, might, I, I can do it, but that's not for me all day. I might go from the edge. Edge. Hey, from the edge. I might crack, crack him. Yeah. yeah. I might crack him. Yeah. But I'm not going to take do you love that? Try to, I love that. You love, I know you love that. I can tell I in your eyes you love that. You see his eyebrows just jump Hey, so the receiver coach at STM, though, loves that. Yeah. Look, Coach Lance... That's, Coach Strother from St. Thomas, that's what he believes in. He wants you, he got to be able to block. Yeah, Coach Lance and, like, my brother, those are, like, really who, like, I credit. And obviously watching film from, like, NFL players who I admire. Yeah. Um, but, like, really them two, like, they really taught me a lot of the stuff I know, like how to just be a nasty, aggressive on the yeah, field. Just, like, yeah. don't let the first person, second mm-hmm. person, third person tackle you. Like, yeah. keep going. Yeah. Like, and you, I don't you, care who's in you, but keep going. You do that, and you keep doing that, and you do that for the second, first, second, third quarter. By the fourth quarter, that cornerback wants no more. But I'm still hitting him. Or you just do it one play, get flagged, and then get to come out the game. When the guys, I don't, I think the guys hated more when they like, no, was run when he ran, ran routes or, or when, when he was blocking when we ran the, when we ran the ball. And he yeah. had to throw everybody on the ground every time. I love I was that. people on our sideline. Like, <laughs> he was. He's throwing no, these guys not, into like, the cheerleaders. He's <laughs> the this is a wide receiver. We're talking yeah, to, by this is a wide receiver. Know. WR. I would assume they're going to make you a, a big time goal. Line. They're going to have goal line packages for you, right? Because you are so physical. And I know people have seen the videos of your alley oop dunks in, in in high yeah. school, and like you can get up there. So I would assume that they probably yeah. have some pretty some. Some good red zone packages, goal line packages for you, right? Yeah, the the uh, coach Jimbo he said that like they're gonna have a multitude of ways to like give me the ball and just use me. But I mean, it's pretty early, and they're you know they're still like recruiting, doing all that stuff. Um, but I mean, once time comes, we're probably really gonna dive into how they really want to use me. But like as of now, it's just kind of been like we have a plan for you, but not knowing what that plan is. Yeah. Like I don't know what that right. plan is. Right. Yeah. So this is probably both of y'all because this. I mean, you probably are starting to get into it now because you just got here and you had it for a year. Film, watching film, and you talked a little bit about it with Miles Burn how he can help you through a lot of different things. Watching film, and you can attest to this because you played football here. I'd assume watching film and film study in college is a little bit different than the film study was in high school. It's a little bit more in depth. It's a little bit. Coach, I uh, did a good job. A really good job. Well, no, 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 no doubt. But like as far as like coverages and as far as like like mm-hmm. you know mixing up coverages and oh, and yeah. blitz like all that stuff, yeah, I would assume that's a, a little bit more. Game. It's a little bit harder, right? So like, what goes into that? How did y'all make? Or have you made that adjustment? How did you make the adju- the adjustment to understanding that and and being prepared for that? Yeah, I mean, absolutely. Like I said, just having a guy like Miles Burn in the room and like obviously the quarterback coach, Coach Sloan. I mean, I'm really excited to get to like be able to work with those guys. But like Miles Burn, he's I'm going to learn so much more, learn more than anything from that guy. Yeah. Just because it's been here, Joe Joe Burrow. Like, he's had so much experience and just having a guy like that in the room. No doubt. That's just an elder guy that's in the room. It's just going to be, it's going to, it's going to help my game so yeah. much more. And I don't think there's a guy that likes LSU more than Miles Brennan, it feels like, because he had the opportunity to leave multiple times. He hits the transfer portal, gets the opportunity to come back, and he doesn't blink. He's absolutely. like, absolutely, I want to be back at LSU. And he doesn't know. It's not like he was promised a starting position, but just the fact to put on the purple and gold one more time, like that has to, that speaks volumes to what you guys are doing. Like Louisiana mm-hmm. Cats, like I know he's from Mississippi, but he has that same mentality of Louisiana guys that want to come in and make the program special. Yeah, he's working his tail off. I mean, he, he pushes me, and I want to make sure I push him. And anything I can do to push him, I try to do. But he's doing, he's pushing me hard. That's, that's all I know. Can you dance? Absolutely not. Me either. Can you dance? You, no. seem, like, you seem like you'd be someone uh, like this. So I, I, like, no, I, I, no, I do no, dance, and I try to dance. No, I do dance, and I try to dance, but I can't dance. Are you a better dancer than Brian Kelly? Are you a better dancer than Brian Kelly? Hey, my thing is... I don't know if I would be. I'm talking about Brian, Coach Kelly. He's got everybody in the I world. I love that. That's what I said. Everybody. That's what I said. I mean, I he's like, getting... 
10, 50 10 million, million views. That's what I said. Per I one said, of who those cares? Videos. These recruits are coming in here, and he's he's in, he's doing this for the for the good of the team. He's gonna embarrass himself, quote unquote. But this guy's gonna have fifteen million views That's on it. He's gonna come. I, like, I who looked cares? at the comments after Daniel Lewis did, and was like, Kayson was like, I'm next. Hey, like, got it, like. I would do it again. And Jack yeah. would do it hey, again. Wait, the real question is, wait, no doubt. So no I would do it with a little wait, podium with Coach Kelly and just be like. So when it's just the team, wait, so when it's just the team, have y'all got him to do it again? Or is it just the, hey, just man, the recruits? Like, just, hey, just the only recruiting thing? Or like, how, how's that go? I don't know. No, I feel like I feel like now y'all gonna have to make him dance. Yeah, y'all gotta make him do this. Y'all gotta make him do something. Y'all gotta make him do this. Whether y'all video it or not, y'all gotta. I know y'all haven't had too much time with him, right? Like, he's been probably recruiting a lot. Yeah, and I think like now, kind of recruiting is kind of slowing down because mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. after tomorrow, it's yeah, done. after tomorrow, it's done, right? So man, I'm excited said. for tomorrow to see what happens. Yeah, with some guys. yeah, yeah, yeah. I got some big guys. I think that we yeah. get. Cool. Y'all got any, any inside the info? Breaking news on the show or what? They don't. They don't. I don't even think like nope. a bunch of guys like that don't know until. Ten minutes before they sign that paper, okay. yeah. to be completely honest. Yeah, I thought we get some breaking news on. I know. Yeah, that's yeah, where you were, like, like, yeah. like, like, like guys don't know because like I remember Malik Neighbors. I remember watching his. Yeah, literally. Mississippi literally. State till all the way to the end, and then all of a sudden, like I'm watching this live. I'm like, he's going to Mississippi State. And like, he's got an LSU hat up there. But like two I was like, minutes why before, why does he have he, this he, on the he, table? Like grabs Mississippi State hat and throws it, puts it. Which is awesome. Hat. Oh, I think it's I was great. unbelievable. It's a trick. I was going, I was, I was in class, and I was like sneaking my phone over on my <laughs> yeah. computer, like watching behind the rubber. And I was like, I was like, <laughs> I was like, dude, Malik just went to LSU. Malik just went to LSU. And he's like, what? And he's like, what? Yeah. Looked at it, like, that no awesome. idea. Yeah. Did you? So, since we're talking about recruiting, you got offered by Vandy, right? That was your first like big offer, I would assume, right? Like big academic unquote. school over there. And then, so what changed? What made Everyone else started offering you, and was it the fourth star, or was it Catholic Baton Rouge game? Was that it? Is that it? Is I, it think you were, I don't know, because I did the same games. stuff to them my junior year. <laughs> <laughs> I've been doing this. Why y'all looking at no confidence. I love that. Hell yeah. <laughs> I mean, the, my state championship game junior year, yeah. I went for four. I would, say, I I like would two, say that, too. I had like 280 all-purpose. But like everyone was saying, I remember Man, like one point numbers. he's got receipts. <laughs> receipts, he's got the receipts. But I remember like at one point everyone was worried about Jack's speed, and I remember I threw a hitch first play, mm -hmm. threw him a hitch. He no one could catch him. He took it for like six. So is that the play? Yards. You think that's the play? That was like, man, this guy's got more than we thought he got. No, and then they watched the whole game. And they're like, <laughs> why? Right. Yeah. So um, obviously, I you think had... I just made. It, it, to where coaches like couldn't they couldn't not offer too me. good to ignore yeah, no, no doubt absolutely. that's how you gotta do you gotta I mean, it was denied. so long like right. I was committed to Vanderbilt and the the, the one of the main reasons I committed to Vanderbilt Nashville. was so I could play in the SEC and show all these I SEC that. teams God, that, that what they missed out on I love that's that that's really why I was going there I love that but did you everything ended up working out so when you so obviously you had uncles played LSU mm -hmm. grew up in Lafayette LSU guy LSU guy dad went to LSU you in the back of your head, you knew if LSU offers you, I'm going. I'm going. Doesn't matter who else. Now you're maybe a little different. I know, but that's that's how I felt when I was yeah. coming out for baseball, and I was trying to do y'all's deal, play football. Then I talked to him, and he said, "Hey, if you want to play baseball, you probably shouldn't do both. It's a little hard. It's probably not good, especially if I was trying to. I wasn't it, like you. I wasn't polished as a quarterback. I was running around there like with my chicken with a head cut off, just trying to sling balls around. I didn't know what I was doing. I wasn't polished. I was like, I don't have time to do that. So I don't. I don't like. For me, it was like I knew I was going to LSU. Right. You knew you were going to LSU. I know deep down that's where you wanted to go, but did it ever waver for you? Did you ever like seriously say, you know what? I don't know if I'm going to LSU. Yeah, I mean it. Don't the lie. End of the, you no, were like I'll be honest, LSU, dude. Dude, I'll, I'll be honest. Like LSU is where I wanted to be. There's no question about it. I mean, this is the greatest place you go. To. Right. You walk into the Tiger Stadium, and you're like Death Valley. You're like, like there's no place like this. How excited are you to run out of the tunnel for the first time? How excited were you around the tournament? What did that Dude, feel like? Honest, I like the Tiger Walk. Ooh, I bet you that's sick. sick. Exactly. I bet you that's sick. Like wearing all of this gear, walking down the Tiger Walk. Hey, you look fresh. You got nice yeah. suits. Yeah. Oh, the on. Tiger Walk is. <laughs> yeah, we does. get, we get like, we have more people at the Tiger Walk than like, if you would take an average attendance yeah. of collegiate football, like we would probably have above the average at our Tiger Walk. Yeah. No, that's all. I love. I, I mean, I've never. Not walked. actually, but like probably. No, yeah, I'm, I'm with you. Like, there's, a, I mean, there's, 
I mean, 40, for, for big, 000, yeah, like for that, big games, right? for big games, you probably have two hundred fifty thousand people yeah. on campus. It's it's pretty hard. So, yeah. you're screaming yeah, at Jack. I said there's a hundred thousand. Hey, in the come talk to me. I always like, said I yeah. wanted to dress out one time and run through the tunnel, just one time to see what it felt like. So I can't imagine walking down, going down the the Tiger Walk, and then going through the tunnel. I mean, you did it a couple times, a few times. Yeah. You got a natty. Yeah. This man got a natty in football and in baseball. Yeah. It's not about me, boys. <laughs> <laughs> You're not here about me. <laughs> oh. Get you one of these. Get you one of these. <laughs> but you got, you got anything for we'll, we'll be matching soon. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Oh. Wait, no. Yeah, we will. I need y'all to understand. Like, y'all probably were here a lot in 19, man. But this place is special, man. When you start winning and you do it and you're supposed help. to be done. Oh, like, just God. around campus, how, like, oh my God. We, like football players get treated. But here's like, the thing. And y'all are going to be here long enough where, like, you got at least two more, right? Y'all gonna be here long enough to where if y'all can establish this thing and get it going right now to see it with expectations. So like it's different. Like in nineteen, like it's the expectations have been here, but we've been it had been a lot of this, right? And nineteen kind of surprised everyone. You put it back on the map this year and you go into the next year with expectations, but obviously this year is the focus. This place is different, man. Different. It's just it's different, man. Have I'm your has your dad gave you told you anything, <laughs> gave you advice, gave you stories about like, man, you gotta do this, you gotta like wait till you see this from when he played. I know it's a lot different, the errors are different. I know there's stuff that you probably can't say on air, maybe, but <laughs> um, you know, stuff that, I guess football stuff. Think. Football stuff. Um no comment? I mean, football-wise, I mean, it's, there's no place like, I mean, it's the greatest four or yeah. five years of your life. Yeah. Like, uh, I mean, you got to love every second. I mean, don't I waste any opportunity that. and work your tail off. I mean, well, your uncles gave you any advice before you got here? Yeah. I don't think, I don't think that, I don't think people got to give you anything to pump you up. I think you got the confidence no, thing oh, down. Yeah. No, they just said. Don't stay they, out too late. They were kind of both walking with, so they really knew the, knew like the ethic of hard work. Mm -hmm. And they just stressed out on me, no matter if you... When the Heisman, the no matter what you do, never be satisfied. Yeah, okay. Keep going. Yeah. Yep. Keep going. Yeah. No doubt. You know? How's it getting adjusted how crazy LSU fans are? Like Walker, I was tagging you in the tweet last night, and it was the wrong Walker Howard account. Like some 45-year-old man has a <laughs> no. Walker Howard account. Like these people are nuts. How do you deal with this? Just like I'm not here to play ball. If there's a bad game, just block it out. Especially with social media now. Because social media yeah. wasn't big 15, it wasn't as big as it was 15 years ago. Right, so now yeah. like everything's scrutinized. Everybody has a has access to talking, trying to get in touch with you, trying yeah. to talk to you, yeah. commenting at you because they don't know what's going on. They don't know what went through it. So how is that? Yeah, how is that adjustment been? I mean, yeah, I know it might be a little. It's a little different between me and Jack just because quarterback and receiver. Just to, I mean, it is different, but um, I don't really know how. Like, I don't really don't know how I'm gonna really handle it yet. Just because maybe I might get off of social media for a time. Like the Georgia quarterback, he's not even on any social. He is. He's not on any social media. I mean, it's great. But yeah, I mean, but yeah. Oh, yeah. You didn't get that. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm it's just like going it's, 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 it's different for that guy. This guy. This guy is like. For, oh, he's got to have that. He's yeah, got to have that. For me, Jack all the smoke. I for me, it. all the smoke. For me, I would say like honestly, those people don't mean anything. Like, no, I've yeah, had, absolutely. I've had stuff getting sent to me before. He's he's had stuff get like. These people don't know you. They don't know. Yeah, like, they don't know. And they're talking about I mean, we're all emotion. humans. People yeah. mess up. They mess up every day in their regular yeah, life. No it, just, it just it just amplifies. I'm sure y'all all heard things too, to where you just like, what did this man just say? Yeah. But it just amplifies it. You're gonna see a lot more of that. Literally, people have no clue who you are. No, yeah. I, I mean, I agree. I mean, that's, that, what I'm that's all it is. Yeah. Dude. And it it's makes it more fun, noise, man. It, it makes it more fun. It makes it more fun whenever you ball out and you're like, hey, look at me now. What you gotta yeah. say to me now? And then they want to be your best friend after, and you know. Yeah, I mean, that's just how it is. Yeah. I mean, that's just how it goes. It's been like that since high school. I mean, yeah. you just you can't get. Do y'all got? Do y'all have? Y'all have? He was gonna go to Vanderbilt on a spite, on a spite oh, yeah, scholarship. Yeah, yeah, you know, spite tour. <laughs> a spite tour. Yeah, like, hey, you know what? You didn't recruit me. You didn't recruit me. You didn't recruit me. Watch this. <laughs> Watch Transfer portal. Are y'all? Y'all have like uh, tutors or anything going on? Y'all got any time? Y'all got some time to stay? You can't yeah. get until we just talk. We're talking about y'all, but we're gonna talk Tom. We're gonna talk football. We're gonna talk kind of NFL. Joey B, if y'all want to just sit down. Okay. On the I'm, show. I just gotta be back to the facility by like. 5.15. Oh, you'll be done. I got to go. I usually I, I'm, I have to start stretching after um, with one of our uh, trainers. That's all I got. No, oh, I'm chilling. I don't do it. chilling. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> Just <laughs> chilling. Like, like, I'm done. What y'all got? What you got on time? Okay, being cool. What you got on time? Greatest, greatest football player of all time? I mean, there's. I, I don't think there's a I question. Think football player of all time. I think he's. Be yeah. Time. Okay. okay. I mean, Who's the great, okay. greatest football player? Who's the greatest yeah. football player of all time? 
You did this to yourself. That's a long list. <laughs> it seems like a long list. This, the list can't be that long. Who we got? Jerry Rice. Jerry Rice, primetime. Well, I do like primetime. I mean, yeah. I think if Bo Those Jackson, dudes look like they're playing Pee Wee football. I think if Bo Jackson NFL. doesn't get hurt, he's the greatest football player of all time. Yeah. Yeah, that's, yeah it's a little different. But, but he I got mean, hurt. Yeah. Tom but greatest Brady. QB of all time, for Dude, sure. Now, Tom, you can't argue against him. He, like he, he does not lose. Bored of, he got bored of winning Super Bowls. If, if do you think that Tom Brady is say not just football? Do you think Tom Brady Brady is the greatest <laughs> athlete? Not just like pure athleticism. Obviously, obviously, obviously. you've seen the pictures. You see yeah, yeah. him on. But like as a, as far as like you know all the big names in all the sports, do you think he is the best of all time? I think it's hard to say. Just but I mean Michael like like Michael Jordan like you compare them to. I mean. They're very similar. I mean, they they don't like when the time comes, like the like late in the game. Michael Jordan comes in clutch. Tom Brady comes in clutch. Like those guys, just when they need to win, they win. Mm-hmm. And I mean, they have the rings. Yeah. Like when they're in this, when they're both all playing the Super Bowl, you can't bet against them. And that's that's literally like what was it? Was it was it Tom Brady that we're talking about? We were, we were looking at each other. We're like, you just can't bet against Tom Brady. You can't. Yeah. You well, really dude, can. it was probably during the Rams game. Whenever they're what? They're down by four 20, touchdowns. 20, 20, 20, and then one Came turnover. Back, and yes. you could see the Rams going, fuck, we keep giving Tom the ball back. Like, <laughs> and he keeps scoring. Yeah. And it got close to the point where if Matthew Stafford doesn't recover that fumble, it, like what, with two minutes left? Like he drops it, picks it back up, and they're able to win the game. But if they turn it over one more time, there's zero doubt in your mind that Tom Brady's going to go down and score again. Yeah, he's, like, that's the biggest thing you can have as a competitor is like he puts fear in your heart. He's one of the funnest guys to watch this like whenever late he, in the game. Whenever he started bleeding and his helmet was off, he was walking off the sideline. He knew it. I looked at him and they were so down. Like I think they were down it was like three touchdowns. Yeah, like three touchdowns. I looked at Walker, I said he he's about to win this game. Yeah. The and bloody he almost game. damn. I was trying to I was trying game. to get that turn name, it didn't work. On Twitter. Oh, I'm not, I don't have it, huh? If they had a one, I was trying yeah. to get it. I kept saying, Blay Lip Game, Blay Lip Game. I did it like three times in the game. I kept, I kept on, quoting it. I was like, come on, work, one time. He didn't win. He didn't win. But, but yeah. Um, well, I think, though, back on that point, I think MJ is a more international type beat, though. You yeah. know, basketball's playing all over the world. Mm-hmm. Football no isn't. Like, way more people know yeah, Tom's MJ got Giselle, and what he did than the people know. What? Tom's got Tom. Giselle, though. Giselle? Yeah. Got international. international. Yeah, she yeah. is. What you got? Nails. She's nice, huh? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, yeah, Tom, the girlfriend, right? Yep. You got a girlfriend, so yep. you be carelful. Yeah, I know. You love your girlfriend. But I think, yeah, but I'm, I think just, I'm just making just, yeah. I'm just saying, like, I'm just making an observation. Yeah, yeah, I, I saw this. You have a girlfriend? Just letting you know. Okay. Just broke so many hearts right there. Yeah. No, he he did. He, that's he, some, he that's what I'm saying. But some some girl was like, oh, maybe. Like, nope, never mind. <laughs> But don't you think that Tom, like, if he's able to get, like, some sort of logo, like the Jumpman that, that Jordan has, if he can do something like a little goat or something with his branding company, he'll be able to build his brand to the point where you almost think he's synonymous with Michael Jordan, because that's what separated him. That's what I'm saying. People pay Buku money. $40,000 for a limited pair. Of, no, it's in, different. A, a, a that's different. Jordan. Michael Jordan is done playing, and Tom Brady ended his career like yeah. that. It's week. a little different, though, because basketball is a little more still fashion, like yeah, stuff. shoes and but, stuff. But MJ was wearing his shoes whenever he was yeah, playing. Yeah, yeah right. it's, it's different. It's different. It's different. Yeah, yeah, but, the, but we're yeah, talking but about... It's, it's different. It's different than the... No, yeah, but... It would never be as big as Okay, yeah, but we're what? talking about... This. I thought we were talking about greatest, like, athletes. I agree. We're, yeah, we're not talking about brand wise. Yeah, we're talking about, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I think Michael Jordan and Tom Brady... Not the coolest, the greatest. Yeah, like... I think MJ's the coolest and the greatest. I, I think MJ's awesome. I love... I'm I think he's, I think he's unbelievable. I think he's... I'm not even going to ask y'all about the MJ-LeBron situation, but... MJ's the best player. To yeah, I think MJ, yeah. I go... MJ, guys, yeah. love that. All, all day. I'm on board with y'all. I think... I think LeBron doesn't gonna, have... LeBron's I think LeBron's going to break every record ever in the NBA. I think talent-wise, like... Whatever, but as far as everything encompassing and like yeah. transcending the game, I'm with y'all. I'm what did LeBron MJ have? changed what the game, literally. Yeah, MJ changed, changed the game. He made the game what it is now. At least part big reason why it is what it is now. Mm-hmm. Um, all right, I'm gonna let y'all. What were you gonna say about LeBron? He doesn't have what? <laughs> yeah, I don't know what you're about to say. I was about to say he doesn't have a killer. If you go instinct? watch, if you like uh, the MJ series, whatever. The, the last dance. The last dance, like MJ, he Let's was always he didn't like. If MJ got hit in the face, his mindset was like... Hit me again. Was like, bet, like, Le- come on. MJ if the would Bron make gets in the stuff. face, If the Bron gets in the face, he's like... 
throwing his hands up, trying to get like. Well, it's a product of the era he's in. I'm about to say, I think that's I think that's a whole part of like the era they're in though, right? Yeah, now. I, yeah. that's what I'm saying. Guys like him, the, guys like him, the they, games like that, that are physically imposed. They don't get fouls unless they act. That's like, just like how it is, like with Brett Favre and like when he was playing football, and like right now, it's just like. If you get hit in the head, like I mean, it's a lot of there's a lot of rules, but I mean, obviously what? I'm a quarterback. You love Brett Favre, huh? You're a Brett Favre guy. I love Brett Favre. Dude, he's a, he's a gunslinger, yeah. bro. Brett Favre guy. Is that, is that what you yeah. think you are, a gunslinger? Is that like would you, if you someone said, hey, give me the type of quarterback you are, build your Madden profile. Yeah. Brett Favre would definitely be a fun quarterback to play with. Yeah, because you're always getting it. You're always, always open. Getting the There's ball. not a window he didn't and like. Just yeah, actually, that's, window he didn't that's actually that's actually a good qu- uh, question. As a receiver, or or you're a quarterback, but like with the guys in the NFL, out of all the guys in the NFL, Tom Brady now he's retired, he's gone. All right, Adam Schefter almost fucked that up. Buried him. Yeah, he tried to like take his retirement tour away. But out of all the quarterbacks that are in the NFL, who do you think to be the most fun quarterback to play with? They're asking y'all. <laughs> I think Burrow? either jo- dude, Josh I would make Joe Burrow. Like Joe literally, he makes me so far. I was screaming. Ooh, <laughs> like we were talking ooh, about Joe Burrow. Joe Burrow, dude. Like literally, he's my background. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like after the game, I thought it was Giselle. I wasn't sure. I didn't know. <laughs> no, no, no. After Have you met him? It literally met? went to Joe Burrow. Like, Have you met Joe yet? I met him when it was like when I was recruiting, like before the 2019 yeah. year. But I mean, he's like like what he did at LSU. Like he gave the ball to his athletes. Like. Yeah, like just that's make plays. like he let that like the athletes make the play like Jamal so Chase is like mm-hmm. not, not I'm not talking about best quarterbacks. No, yeah. I'm not talking about best young quarterbacks. I'm just talking about as far as like we talk you, about, you talk about Brett Favre. You say Brett Favre, I'm always open. You never he's always gonna let the thing. To me, in my head, there's two in my mind that come like right to mind. Like obviously, Joe to me is like the best young quarterback right. in the game. I was comparing him to I'm not even gonna say what I was comparing him to. Joe Montana. Like, no, it's more than that. I was comparing him to Tom. Tom? Early Tom, like he, Tom won the Super Bowl. He's about to win the Super Bowl in the second year right now. Here, here's what here's what I'll elevate him over Tom. Patrick Mahomes. I'll say Mahomes yeah. or Josh Allen. Wait, wait, that's that's always, I, just said, I just said Patrick Mahomes or Josh yeah, Allen. Yeah, that's what yeah, I was saying. Because you're Josh always Allen open. Has a cannon. There's not a, there's not a spot. Who does? Josh Allen. Yeah, we talked about this. We'll yeah. throw a fade ball. I think Josh Allen could be better than Mahomes hand at hand some point. I think that he could be better than Mahomes at some point. Talent wise, I'm not talking about overall, all encompassing, but talent wise, you put them both on the field. And you said, hey, I just want you to have a skills competition. Josh Allen may outperform Patrick Mahomes. But the thing about Mahomes Maybe. is in-game that's, situation. Yeah. Right. That's the difference. Like, that's the difference. Like, that's what, that's what, situation, like, he just finds ways to get That's what gives him. That's what elevates him. Standing up. That's what elevates him. I'm just talking about Jeez. pure arms. Like, Josh Allen. Dude, I think mean, Mahomes, like, I remember yeah. Mahomes even came oh, out. He was, like, he was like, I think Josh, someone said Josh Allen can throw, like, farther than me, like, like I would be down to see like. Have you seen video of him on his knees? And he throws to the other side of the oh, end zone. On, on Madden, oh, yeah. if I play Madden, I mm-hmm. only play with the Bills. I will only. <laughs> I mean, think about this. Josh Allen, uh, in Madden, they have. You're supposed to like, go rando squad, <laughs> dog. What you no, mean? No, no, no. Whenever they like the way it's set up in Madden is Lamar Jackson speed in the backfield, like pocket speed and like get out. Josh Allen's speed is the same. So yeah, like, he's, he's, he's doing he's that escape, but but if he stops and throws, like he's throwing it like. That's the eight. thing. Like, and the, on a, on a you can he can be rolling yeah. right, just sick. You can be running just a clear out so route on the opposite side and still be open, <laughs> right? Like that's that's Pretty my OP. thing. As a receiver, like there's not one position. There's a, there's a routes in the receiver. Like, hey, you're not supposed to get the ball here, but there's all you're always available because on a guy like that, he can throw the ball 80 yards down the field. That's me. That would be to me and be the most fun thing. Yeah, that right? would be fun. But it would be. Do y'all not like know scrambling? about scrambling? Like know? your quarterback isn't about to just drop it down low. Like he's gonna stop. And like scrambling, just yeah, let it go, go get it, just rip it. Yeah, go get Mahomes it. would be fun. Yeah, that'd be yeah. Mahomes and I think to me those two Mahomes probably the most fun because like they're slinging. Their the play is never over, and yeah. you're always open. Well, that's what makes Joey B so kind of special is he doesn't have the same arm talent that. exactly, or the same. I don't think he's as fast, but he has the escapability a little bit. Like you saw Patrick Mahomes kind of run himself into trouble at the end of the AFC Championship. Like what he does great kind of was his. Biggest downfall a little bit because the Bengals D tightened up, but you saw Joe Burrow, and the reason I like him so much, and I think you would probably feel the same way, he never blinked. Like the entire game, he like they left him alone on the cooler. They never talked to him, and the only time he ever showed any emotion was in overtime when he thought he wasn't gonna get the ball because if I can get my fucking hands on this thing, I'm gonna win the game. And that was it. Like that's what makes Joe Burrow special to me. Without the arm talent of a Patrick Mahomes or a Josh Allen, like that was Joey B's got that. 
So your dad just texted me. Your dad just texted me. He said, "Don't ask Walker about any players before 2018. He doesn't know any NFL players before 2018." <laughs> <laughs> you got anything to say about that? I didn't know that. Is that factual? I didn't know he knew how to get on links and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Walker, <laughs> hey, how do you do this? Hey, man, look, 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 I can't smi- do it. He's just smiling. Like, yeah, he's just smiling. Oh, he's wearing his glasses like, like this. Yeah, he's like, he's like, oh. he's like oh. <laughs> <laughs> those jerks. Did you follow Lincoln Riley again? <laughs> yeah, he's, what did he what does follow me? Oh my god, he, that, he called that? me. He was like, Do you know Lincoln Riley's gonna be our next coach? Because he like saw me and Jack, like he was like looking at this stuff and he's like, See, <laughs> he's like, How did you know like Lincoln Riley's like all this stuff? Like people are calling him like Lincoln Riley's next guy. And he's like, I was like, Looking, I was like, Oh yeah, me and Jack are just messing around. Like, that was the word from <laughs> everybody. Like, right, no, I mean, like we past players, recent players. I mean, I, we were, we were, I was hearing all the time. I mean, that's like, what we were saying. That, that was it, really. That I mean, was that's, really it. I was telling people I was going to be Lincoln yeah, Riley, was and then it wasn't Lincoln Riley, and everybody was like, well, you're an idiot. Like, what are you doing? Yeah, I, felt, I, was like, I was like, yeah, we promoted that dude so much. <laughs> well, dude, it was yeah, we, we got that dude's contract up. We got every, yeah, and like I was thinking we got and nine now you know know what we're all these guys. I was like a little worried at first. Caleb like, Williams transferring to USC, duh. Are you yeah. kidding me? Like, do we think he was going anywhere else? But now you know what we're going to do, huh? In Vegas in two years? They're going to beat their ass. What about you? you are. I mean, you got Max yeah, Johnson yeah. coming up too. Okay. Next year. Let's not. Let's not. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy, easy I'm over just saying, there. I'm just let's Gal- not Gal- get into Gal- that. Gal- SEC to SEC, my Jesus goodness. Lord. He's going there. Follow his brother. Follow yeah, yeah. his brother. Okay. Jim Thought Go- he was the big Jim brother. Go- Jim Glenn. Go- oh, maybe the big brother turned into his little brother. Who knows? We're not getting into that, okay? No, we're, gonna, no. we're gonna be nice. We're not. Gonna <laughs> we're gonna be nice. Yeah, exactly. We're gonna be nice, and we're gonna we're gonna talk about I'm sports. Gonna Cross that bridge we're, we're gonna, gonna talk about nice sports. Ball. We're about to get to gambling. They have, these guys got to go study because they're they're collegiate athletes. They're student mm-hmm. athletes. Student first. I really do have a paper right now. See, I gotta take well, a, I gotta go. take an art. You gotta write the whole paper. Today? You got an art art quiz. Art quiz. Like what art rough, history rough, or rough like draft. Art. Art. What do we major in? Wait, wait, hold on. I'm curious. What goes into an art quiz? Do you have to draw or like? No, they show you like paintings yeah. of old school. No, that's art, art history. Is so, that what it is? I've been taking it. I was saying that'd be so art history. I just right? want to get ahead of things real quick and take it today. You know, nice. <laughs> you just <laughs> always find something out about the class. Like, like, there's always something. You don't read the always syllabus. a loophole. You don't read the syllabus. There's. No. I do. I read it with my. my you read the tutors. syllabus. Our tutors read the syllabus, and then they kind of let us know. Like, is rate my professor still a thing? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, Yes. Oh. Yeah, yes. It is. Okay. It's where's your favorite? Where's your favorite place on campus to go to school? Who we actually to does that? <laughs> like, <laughs> I went to class for no, the first time today and yesterday. Oh, yeah. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. <laughs> oh, we have somebody that walks in there. <laughs> Skip. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. <laughs> our, Great. our new coaches Dang. are very tight and all that stuff. Dude, right? No, like, it. you have to go to class. We have a lady but, that literally. Yeah. I don't know about y'all. Yeah. We have a lady that like literally like, makes sure we're on time. Yeah. Hits a little yeah, check true. mark and says, "Yeah, he's here." But the reason I said that, the reason I said I said is because all the classes I'm taking, I'm taking five. Two of them are all online, and the other three are either virtual or you can go in person. Okay, so you're a big in person guy. No, I just like going on virtual. He's like hell. So for me, for me, my convenient. For me, my favorite football. Yeah, like twenty minutes after the class, and I'm sitting. I wish I had that. It was tough. We had to go. Literally, had had a workout. Uh, Did you get lost? Movie. I got lost the first day going to camp, camp uh, class. I had to call my a- academic uh, advisor them, and say they walk like, us to class, uh, or they brought uh, us to the golf cart. Well, I mean, what you the got heck? What? You got what? You got what? What? You got driven what? on a golf cart? If you like, if, they need, if you need to go to class, it come, uh, somebody's bringing you a golf cart. Quincy comes, grabs you on the scooter. Is this a caddy service? <laughs> well, I got a scooter, but yeah, the golf Who did? cart. You, you said know. cool. No, Quincy, Quincy, when you got hit with a scooter on the scooter, did y'all see that video? No, crazy. Right. He'd have been so much worse. I mean, he's the fact that he bounced right up. That's like, my this boy. This guy's a monster. That's Literally. my boy. You need to have Quincy over here. That is my boy. Let's get him. Can you get him on here? Absolutely. We, we come, come with him. him. I bring think him on got here. him this fifth star. Bring, bring it, whoever wants to come on here, bring him on here. See, yeah, it's fun. Yeah, he did, dude. Listen, I'm not asking dude. you dumb questions. I'm just, I just want to have a conversation yeah. with him. I'm asking yeah. the dumb ones. He's asking the dumb ones. That's what he's supposed to look. He's, look at his hair. Look at you. <laughs> but now you just. <laughs> what? But, what? <laughs> What's that? I'm just saying, but now the, like, those stays got to be fire, though. I got you. Next week. Yeah. I'm coming back on Sunday. I'll, fire. I'll make fire. Uh, the fire. Nobody makes a better steak than me. 
Dude, I can't wait. And we'll see. That's a big oh. take right that there. Right. Take right. Right. I will say, right. Mikey Start. has a fire set up outside. So I, I can't wait to go to your big crib. Yeah. I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so I mean, he's texting me like, oh, big time with me already. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah, just yeah. glad I got your number. <laughs> I'm just trying to get it, I've been waiting since class. I was like hey, six Don't put me on blast like that. Does everybody know the background with me and Mikey? Me and Mike, I've been knowing Mikey since. I've been knowing you since this day. Yeah. My aunt's because, godmother. Yeah. So I've been going there at Christmas there, all their family stuff since. I've been this big. Seen my, little, my, sister, been eating, my sister used to babysit him. Mm-hmm. Well, well, me and Steven probably got some terrible stories. Y'all, they were shitheads. Dude, he's, yeah. Yeah. When they were little. So you and Steven used to, wait, you and Steven used to run around yeah. a lot? The twins. Yeah, the twins. My oh, sisters. Boy, that's oh, yeah, yeah, the twins. My sisters. Yeah, the twins were. Dude, I, no, I haven't seen them in so long. long. Yeah, they're good. They're, oh, they live in New Orleans. One's got two kids. Wow. Wow. Babysitters ever. Oh, I bet. <laughs> There's like stories of Jack like climbing trees when he was like just in his. Oh yeah, Jack like, was not climbing trees. They would say, "Come down." Come He's like all the way at the top where it's like night. He's like climbing. Jack higher. wasn't the one. He couldn't rail. You couldn't reel him in. No, no, no shot. Most no of He's the same. He's like the, like so like a knock like. Which y'all okay? So what y'all schedule next week? What y'all schedule next week? Same on thing. air, look. I it's can't go thing. back now. We're on air. We have to. I have to. Well, I have to the same it. thing as this week. <laughs> we can't go back. <laughs> what is same it? thing as this week. Same All right. Thing. So Monday or Tuesday next week. I'll, whatever day you want, yeah. I'll get it. I'll get it set up. I'll go get them. Have a marinade for us. We'll get them. And, and you got a hot tub butter. Should we do Wednesday? No hot tub, just a pool. Should we do Wednesday? That's fine. It's cold. Jack, I don't care. Should we do Wednesday? Yeah, I don't care. Because we take our nap right after, and we can literally just. I do sleep all day. <laughs> on Wednesday? Yeah, but, yeah, but, yeah, but, yeah, but no, Wednesday works. It's going to be at night, probably, I'm guessing. Yeah, yeah, it's going to be at night. It's going okay. to be at night. Right. Yeah, Actually, think. Wednesday, yeah, let's do Monday or Tuesday. Okay, perfect. That sounds good. One, we, one of those two days, we'll figure it out yeah. that night. We'll get it. Easy. Easy. Perfect. Easy. Dude, y'all are the best. Easy. We got we to gotta get y'all. Anytime y'all want to come back in here, Woo. y'all come in here. I can't wait to eat that steak. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was really like, y'all. And I thought we were going to take the night. I'll hook y'all up. I would. I'm leaving tomorrow. I'm leaving tomorrow for Cancun. So if I wasn't, I would do it tonight. But Ooh. I got I got a pack. Yeah, we got a wedding. What, what am I hiding your uh, suitcase? <laughs> we got a wedding in Cancun. We got to go to. <laughs> That's um, fun. All right, boys. I let you, I kept y'all in here for almost an hour. Y'all are the best. That's fun. Absolutely. Anytime, any, fun. anytime y'all want to come back in here, y'all are a lot, y'all are whatever y'all want. Y'all have a platform to do whatever y'all want to do on here. Um, Golf cart if you need it. Blood runs deep, bro. The family. The family. The family. The family. The family. <laughs> Blood runs deep. Blood. Um, Blood. All right, we're going to take a little break because we got to go back and talk about our bets. Yeah. Talk Shout about out to our the bets. boys coming in. Thank you Shout guys. out to the boys coming in. Go. Go. We had a big ass day. We had a big yeah. day. You yeah. got me a bunch of y'all got me a bunch of followers today. I appreciate that. Let's go. I pre- huh? We hit a thousand. We hit a thousand. Numbies. Look at that. Let's go. Numbies. You got some merch going out here? We got we got some numbies today. I love yeah. that. All right, we're going to take a break. The last thing I'm going to need from you is some merch. And we're good. Oh, we get you, I'm going to get you some okay. merch. I'm gonna, get you. I'm gonna let you. I'm gonna, you know what I'm gonna do next week. I'm gonna have a catalog. You pick out what you want, and I'll put the merch on it. Say less. I'm gonna. All right. That's all I need to know. All right, we're gonna take a little bit of break. Y'all, y'all listening to Mike'd Up, watching Mike'd Up. Brought to you by Sterling Automotive. Uh, big shout out to the boys, Walker and Jack. Thank you all Definitely. for coming in. See y'all again later. Y'all and, still uh, out there playing Madden? Take a little break. What you mean, man? It's like bigger than that. No, but the, the new one's not that good. No, the new one's good. The new, the one's new one's great. Good. No, the last good one guy. was Odell. Old man screaming from the yard. I am. I am. He, can, hey, he can't beat me on Madden 20 or 21. Whenever we put on Madden We've never played 22 ever. Here we go. We've never played. Go. I've been hey, here, 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 here we go. Here we go. Stop. He's like, stop lying right now. We played the same person. He got beat 42 21, and I beat the kid. I just don't it's because oh, I don't play with a PS5 in no, no, that like the A. It was like the <laughs> square. Yeah. It was like yeah, the yeah, yeah. square on the X. That, 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 I was, was, still, I was I literally was, like watching I the cross. I was a PlayStation guy. I literally so you you got thrown to the outside receiver. I'm clicking the button. Yeah. It just throws it to the inside you grew receiver. Up, like, you grew up Xbox guy. You grew up PlayStation guy. I grew up both. Both. Okay. It was Xbox. Here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. We got a big ass TV in there called Big Ball. Big Ball. But we can't play on the biggest TV because that got okay. stream lag. Oh my god, dude! I'll okay, we'll play on one of the smaller TVs. We'll play on one of the smaller TVs. We're gonna bring. We'll get a. We'll get a console. We play it here, and we're all gonna sit here. We're gonna stream it, and y'all gonna play. Me and Jack. On, so you and Jack. I'll whoop them every time. Here we go. <laughs> here we go. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna but I'm bringing my PS5. Bring I'm it. bringing my Xbox too. Oh, See, okay, so we'll, we'll go one and one. one. We'll go one and Bro. one. We'll get one game one each. I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna have to get a PS5 and just start playing. Practice well, I thought you had plenty of those, yeah. dude. Yeah. <laughs> I played one time. I was no. literally like throwing. You were selling them on Instagram. 
I thought you were selling the PS5s. Yeah, I wish. I, made so much money. <laughs> God, I wish right. it was really. I wish it was like that. Okay, we really are going to a break. We're a little bit of break. Got to get our bets in order. Uh, let the boys go and do their do their homework. Are you like for the Super Bowl? Oh yeah, yeah. Super Bowl picks. Burrow all day. Can't go. Can't go. I'm not. I don't look. Even if they were playing one of the best teams ever in the NFL, I'm putting. I'm Love putting it. I'm with you. On Burrow. I'm with you. I put money you on Burrow to. last week against yeah, the uh, Chiefs. All right, boys. Thank you all again, yep. man. Y'all are the best. We're going to take a little break. See you in a little bit. Sweet. Boom. Damn, I thought you just broke that thing. You guys should hang up. Of course. You all fucking can't see it, boy. Yeah.